<laughs> this visit was all about the military patient, so David Beckham and Ray Winston entered the hospital via a back door this afternoon and headed straight to ITU before going to the main military ward. These kids are out there protecting my children and the world, whatever the world's going to be, you know, when I'm dead and gone. So I think it's only right that myself and the rest of the country support them. It didn't take long for word to spread that the celebrities were here. Both stars are big supporters of the military and have been to Afghanistan, David Beckham most recently in 2010. Staff here say a visit by such high profile celebs definitely boosts morale. Oh, I think it means a lot. I mean, some of the patients, the military patients, are here for months at a time, and being in hospital is a pretty boring experience for the patients. So it just adds that bit of adventure and a bit of a difference to the day. It's just nice to have people to care about the military patients, really, and the military staff and the NHS staff that work to, to look after to give the best care to the patients. So it's nice to know that they care about what we're trying to achieve here at QE. The pair spent nearly three hours here at the hospital with military patients. David Beckham then went on to visit the Children's Cancer Ward. Uh, pretty amazing, you know, obviously I've uh, been out to Afghanistan before and then uh, a few years back and then to come here today and to see the work that not just obviously the guys here uh, have, have been through, um, but the work of the nurses, the work of the doctors, I think it's pretty an, pretty amazing place. and. It's very uplifting because you're meeting the guys, you're meeting some of the troops and, you know, they are very kind of positive about life and about, you know, their future. So it's, it really is, uh, has been an inspiring visit. As you say, you got a chance to chat to quite a few of the guys here. I saw you talking to them. What did you chat about? Um, just general stuff, really, because, uh, you know, we all know the reason why they're here and, you know, their injuries that, that, that they've got and, uh, and what's going to happen to them in the future but uh, just general stuff kind of what they did at Christmas and what I did at Christmas and um, talked a little bit about football but um, you know it's great to meet them and great to meet you know their families because they've got a lot of support um, you know around them but uh, it's just kind of trying to tell them and uh, reiterate to them how much support they've got outside of their families and, and you know outside of this little world they're, that they're in at the moment. And you mentioned that, of course, you went to Afghanistan in 2010. Do you think that trip helps you or gives you a little bit of an insight into perhaps what they've been through? It gives you a slight insight. You know, I was only over there for a short visit, two or three days. But, um, you know, like I said about visiting here, you know, it's very inspirational, um, you know, to meet the guys. And you, you really feel the, the intensity that, that, is, uh, that is out there uh, within the camp. And... Um, you know, my visit, like I said, was very inspiring, you know, to meet some of the guys, to see, you know, uh, to hear their stories, to, to kind of be around them for, you know, for the two days that I was. Um, it's very intense, but it's, it really is an amazing thing to be able to do for myself to, to be able to go over and, you know, for them to tell me that, um, you know, how uplifting it is having people like myself go out there and uh, you don't think of it like that and you just kind of want to share stories and talk to them about, uh, you know, what they're going through and, and they're just, you know, they treat it like just any job, you know, they know the reason why they're there, they, they believe in what they're doing and that's, that's the amazing thing about the troops, you know, they, they believe in what they're doing uh, and that's uh, uh, inspiring enough as it is. And I understand uh, Ray Winston was quite ins uh, instrumental in getting you here today, is that true? He was, you know, he mentioned a couple of weeks back, I saw him just before Christmas and uh, he mentioned that he was coming up and I said, well, great. He said, well, you should come with me. And I said, great, because I'm obviously not playing at the moment, so I've, I've got the time to do that. So it's, um, you know, it's all down to Ray, but I'm glad he brought me up here because it's, uh, it's, it's great to see the work that's been done.